All right, folks, our main weather today is brought to you by Varney Ford. Varney Ford in Newport gives one full year maintenance on every new and used vehicle they sell. Come visit them and see their huge selection of cars and trucks, the nice car and truck people. And it is fall. Of course, November is around the corner. Soon we're all going to be past their peak fall foliage. For now, these colors are really popping out. Just driving around, looking up, it just looks absolutely wonderful. Same story right at the coast, Bar Harbor, Machias, Rockland. You are all looking at some really, really good colors outside. Now, most of the country though they're starting to see uh, the peak fall foliage the southern states they're just seeing some low colors so mostly green all over the area no surprises we've just been having such a strong high pressure system keeping things so warm and dry some places in texas and atlanta georgia have not even seen a drop of rain the last 25 days this might be the first time since 1890 three that Atlanta, Georgia might actually see no rainfall at all in a whole entire month. We do still have a week to go, so we'll see how things go for our area. Dry, dry and dry. And we're going to continue to stay dry for the most part the next several days up until Wednesday time frame. That's when we're going to get a little bit more shower action back in the forecast. Now a little bit more of a milder day Our average right around 55 above average temperatures for today. 56 here in town, 56 right in town by Bar Harbor, Machias, Rockland. You were back in those mid to upper 50s a little pocket of some cooler air up north greenville and then north of that that's where we saw some mid to upper 40s as high temperatures so chilly right might as well put on a couple of layers and stay warm and we're going to need those layers sunday into monday especially high temperatures yes these are high temperatures in bangor only in the mid to upper 40s by Tuesday, much better, warming back up closer to average and then really warming up Wednesday and Thursday. And of course, Thursday is Halloween and it looks pretty pleasant. Maybe a few lingering showers out there. Other than that, very warm. So you might not have to put on three to four layers like we usually do here in the state of Maine. Now, water temperatures, if you're going to be out and about, maybe a little bit of fishing, enjoying the outdoors, water temperatures are slightly warmer than this time last year, back in those mid 50s all over the area. A couple of spots, especially north, uh, closer to Machias you are seeing water temps back in those lower 50s. But speaking of water temperatures off the coast, we are seeing small craft advisories that are in effect till around 2 p.m. on Sunday. They did get extended like expected. Of course, there is a bit of a breeze that will be continuing off the coast the next couple of days. For now, the winds are pretty calm. We're going to continue to see some calm winds all over the area. But Saturday evening, especially by Sunday, we're going to see some very gusty winds, possibly wind gusts close to 30 miles per hour for tonight though. not quite, not even close. Calm winds, mostly clear skies, temperatures around freezing. So if you do have anything to do early tomorrow morning, you will definitely want to bundle up, put on your layers during the day though, upper fifties, near 60 degrees as a high temperature, lots of sunshine outside, a few sprinkles possible in the afternoon. Other than that, most of us will continue to stay dry. Our extended forecast outlook is showing an abundance amount of sunshine the next several days, possibly more chances of rain with low sixties back in the forecast by Wednesday.